name is Maddie Bluebird. Welcome back to another video. So I am going to be grooming or showing how I groom my dog. Uh, first I'm going to cut him, then I'm going to just rinse him off. Typically I would bathe him before this, but he just got a bath the other day. So I'm not going to bathe him twice. Uh, I may put some HIPAA cleanse on his stomach just because he is allergic to staph. And he's been pretty itchy, and I think that's why. So, yeah, I'm gonna get started. So, I did this after grooming him um, because I noticed he was super itchy. Also, to get the loose fur off of him, so I bathed him. Um, he needed it. He was super, super itchy. He has severe allergies. We have to do allergy shots. Um, he's allergic to staff, uh, grass, dust mites, like the whole shebang. So, and he's like severely allergic to staff. So that's why I have to give him a bath quite frequently because of how severe his staff allergic or how much he's allergic to staff. Like if he were to get a cut, it would just blow up. Like, it would be very angry because he would be having an allergic reaction and stuff like that. Staph is a bacteria that grows naturally on the skin. I just wanted to talk about that because I'm sure most people don't know what staph is. Um, but, yeah. So, you can see here, uh, there's some hippoclins in. I just put some hippoclins in that. Uh and I'm washing him down um, with it. And then I'll go over with normal shampoo, bathe him. Um, he was actually really dirty for some reason and I have no clue why. Um, it was kind of weird, um, but yeah. Okay, so here I am getting ready to clip his body. Um, you can see I'm using a guard. This is a, the second size. I go pretty short on my dog, so I think that's like a th third of a fourth of an inch on his body. Uh, don't quote me on that. Um, but... I agree with him myself out of personal choice because I like to keep him short and neat and since he's a service animal, you know, he's seen by the public eye so he, I want him to look professional and, you know, because he's working. Um, but here you can see me going in the same direction as his fur grows besides on his spine and on his chest he has a bunch of calyx uh, so I can't go in the same direction that his fur grows. Um, me backing up the camera. Um, and I let him lay down, roll over. I don't, I want him to be as comfortable as possible during this. Um, because, you know, it, it sometimes takes me a long time, like two hours if I'm really being picky. Um, or if his fur is really long or if I don't Feel like it's right and you can see there with the brush I am brushing his fur up fluffing it up and then going over it with the uh, clippers um, just because sometimes his fur is so fine that it won't get picked up it would just kind of push it over instead of actually getting cut so you do that and then you can shave over it if your dog's fur is really fine um, I find it fairly easy, um, also he's not 
good with other people grooming him. Um, like, when I mean he's not good, he just is, like, can be, like, very much a troublemaker when grooming, and today, actually, he was being a bit of a troublemaker with me, seeing what he could get away with. Um, I asked him to stand there. Uh, again, I'm going in with a brush, brushing the hair up, and then going over it. Um, you can tell he's not happy with it. And then... Yeah, I, I did have to turn off the camera at one point, but... He lays down. He always does that stretch thing, it's so cute. Um, but yeah. Okay, I forgot to mention, I also shave underneath his beard because it gets matted. And underneath his ears, I go in with the same guard that I used to shave his bo body, and I shave underneath there. Because it's so thick that it's just very hard to just get a brush through it, not because it's matted. And it's just easier on him. So, that's why I do that. Um, the beard, I do it because I don't, he's a sloppy, uh drinker and he drools a little bit so it's just better just to shave it for his sake it's more sanitary um so yeah you'll notice in the next clip his beard is a lot shorter you can see so far i've done his body i had to cut off the camera because he was walking around so i was doing it while he was walking around now i'm gonna scissor cut his face, his ears, his brows, and I may do a little bit of trimming up here. Um, but that's pretty much it. And I'll do his tail and then do like sanitary stuff. So, yeah. Okay. I'm right now using curved scissors. Hold it. Yeah, good boy. Hold it. Stay. Hold it. I know. Oh, he's such a good boy. Yes. Look at me. Yes. <laughs> Hi, good boy. You should do good boy. I'm gonna. No, oh, you can see. Okay. Hold her. Come. I know you don't like it, but you have to. Sit. Stay. He flinches his ear every time, almost, when I cut it, so... I don't get why. Maybe it's because of the sound of the shears cutting. But I don't get it. Huh. See, I don't get it. Hold it. Sit.
say. Boulder. No, Boulder. Boulder, come here. Boulder. Come. Sit. Enough. Okay, so here I am doing his head, like the top of his head, and I am using a size 4 clipper, so double the length that he has on his body, and I'm just clipping his head, and then I go through with clip uh, scissors the curved scissors and I do the back of his head because he ha kind of has this angular shaped skull and like he has this high point on his skull and it makes like his hair stick out on the top so to make his skull look actually rounder I uh, go in and I trim that more just to make it look even but then you can see I'm going behind his ears because he does get like he has these like folds in his ears that like, fold over themselves so I'm moving them out of the way to kind of um, make sure they're even You'll be naughty, 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 naughty. Boulder, up, up, come on. The hair that came off of him after two weeks. Um, remember, he is a large dog breed, so like this does not like surprise me or like take me back at all. I'm like, oh. Um, but he was not a happy camper today about me grooming him. Um, he was like, just leave me alone. I just want to sleep. Which I understand, so...
Did it not do a countdown? Guess not. Um, so here you can see me just showing him with my terrible camera skills. Um, sorry I sat it down. But yeah, I was trying to get him to go grab his ball, but he did not want to. Um, where he goes running off. Uh, but yeah.